Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make this delicious and comforting dish baked mashed potatoes with ground beef. So let's dive in. First then first, I'm going to show you what I'm going to use for this recipe. So I'm going to use red potatoes. This is my spice, my pepper. You can use any color you prefer i use a purple onion you can use white onion and i use mozzarella cheese for this recipe ground beef put in tomato paste corn and that's all i'm gonna use for this recipe it's a very quick and easy recipe this water i'm gonna use is to wash my potatoes a clean start is essential so let's peel them cut them into chunk and now we're gonna boil them make sure don't forget to add a pinch of salt and a splash of olive oil cover it and let it cook let it cook while our potatoes are boiling let's get start on the uh, ground beef so what you need to do for the ground beef you're gonna heat up your pan and then add the ground beef we want it nice and brown Perfect! Now it's starting to get brown. It's time to start spice things up. Adding my spice. Stir, stir, stir. And then I'm gonna add my tomato paste. It's gonna give the a beautiful color. So as you can see my spice gets all inside the ground beef now let's add the tomato paste and the mustard After you cook up your tomato paste, it's time now to add the pepper and onions. You, you just have to add everything. Peppers, onion, peas, carrot, and then I'll also taste some chicken bouillon and a dash of hot sauce in there too. If you really really like spicy food now it's time to add the a dash of hot sauce 
if you don't like spicy food you know need to add it but me i like spicy food i'm just gonna add a little bit so you know so and after i'm gonna cover it and then let it simmer on low for like 15 20 minutes and then you're good to go make sure you taste it so now it's time to check on these potatoes they should be tender by now and now we're gonna mash them yeah time to mash them i like to mash them while they are hard so i won't use any milk just some of the boiling water and i'm good to go I, i'm just gonna add some cheese butter just for that extra creaminess so use some of the boiling water too and then mash everything together and until it's nice and smooth so that's what you have to do it's a very quick and easy recipe that everybody can do even a baby can do it i'm joking <laughs> so yeah so let's match everything and then after we're gonna just start to assemble our gist our dish yeah that's how you say it our dish so mash 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 now you're gonna get your aluminium plates make sure you get your aluminium plate ready because the recipe is almost over if you see it hard you just need to hard a little bit more water now i have my aluminium plate um i'm just gonna spread some butter just spread it really 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 well so it won't stick so add the first layer of the mashed potatoes not a lot but enough so make sure you spread the mashed potatoes and then add your ground beef followed by the corn and the blend corn and then add the other layer and then you're good to go it's a very quick and easy recipe you know girl okay so now uh, we adding the ground beef the ground beef is very very tasty very very tasty and the purple onion that's why i like about purple onion it make a difference so try to use it if you if you don't have it you don't have to use it but try to use it now i'm adding the corn and then mm, i'm gonna add the blended corn and add the other layer of mashed potatoes and you all done and tap it off with the mozzarella cheese and yeah guys oh you can eat it just the way it is you can eat it just the way it is if you don't want it to put it in the oven you can eat it just like that it's very very tasty you know me yeah so yeah i'm adding the last layer you only has to anyway so spread it very very well tap it off with some mozzarella cheese i use mozzarella cheese and cheddar cheese and then put it in the oven now we're gonna put it in the oven yeah i put two plates i prepared two plates i'm gonna put it in the oven for 425 for 35 minutes can't wait to see it and now here it is my beautiful big mashed potatoes with ground beef just look at that cheesy goodness i can't wait to dig in thanks for joining today if you enjoyed this recipe let me know in the comment section if you try this at home and happy cooking